Dude, I'm so excited for my ride to Supresa. Oh, I know, me too. My name's Shani, I'm 15, and I'm super excited about my quinceanera because I've been dreaming about this forever. It's finally happening. Quinceanera, it's always been a tradition. My mom's from Guatemala, and my dad's from Salvador. My cousin had a quinceanera, and my sister had one also, so it's a tradition to have one. Shani is so happy. <laughs> she always busy. She like dancing, running, singing. She's so loud. I want to vlog right now because I've been trying to like vlog daily. So can I like vlog us chilling? Okay. I was originally born in Los Angeles. My parents moved to Arkansas when I was seven. I started making YouTube videos in Arkansas because I was I didn't have any friends and I was bored in my room. Hey guys, it's Shani. I make lifestyle videos on YouTube and they range from like DIYs for your room, beauty videos, singing. I always watch it. I always watch it and I tell everybody to watch our videos. I did get inspired by like Bethany Moda and My Life as Ava, Makeup by Mandy. Ooh, they're so good at making videos. <laughs> Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm here with Chloe yeah. in my bedroom. <laughs> Me and Shani are super close. I like to call her my sister. Today we're going to do the cousin tag. Now, I don't know what that is, but Chloe knows what it is, so let's start it off. Okay. For Shani's 15, I'm actually really excited because I'm in her surprise <laughs> dance. It's just really exciting. My baile sorpresa is what I've been waiting for. This is the main reason I want to do my quinceanera. I've been dreaming about having my baile sorpresa since I was like five. And I'd always make like little dance routines in my room, like, Oh, I'm gonna do this for my quinceanera. Oh, this is gonna happen for my quinceanera. It's a big part in my quinceanera because my sister and my cousin would not let me be in the baile sopresa when I was a younger kid. But she was so little, she was like five, six years old. She said, well, I'll wait for my quinceanera and you see, you guys. <laughs> I was watching a TV show and the theme of the show was Alice in Wonderland. So I thought it was perfect for my quinceanera. I was obsessed with all the cool colors and her dress because I didn't want like a princess. I wanted Alice in Wonderland. It's different than anything else. And that's what I am. I'm different, I'm outgoing, I'm out there, so. She wants Alice in Wonderland. I don't know exactly why. Do you see the movie? The little girl, all the people, they're mean with her. You know? She feels maybe the same. We moved to Los Angeles to be with my family because we lived so far away. We'd only see them like once a year. And then I started a new school. And I thought it was gonna be like easy because it was a charter school. I thought no one was gonna bully no one. And it was hard, you know? I was getting bullied in school. And it was just really hard. And uh, yeah. those kids were so different from other kids. Like they started calling me names, started calling me fat, making fun of my appearance. They started throwing me notes, saying none, all these bad things. And it just got to my head so I wouldn't eat. I'd like always be in my room. I'd never go out. I was just really sad. I'd wake up and I'd say, I don't wanna to go to school. I'd pray to God that something like, I can get sick so I don't have to go to school. They ended up getting my phone number and started cyberbullying me. They'd send me long paragraphs about how I'm useless and stuff like that. And it just, yeah. <laughs> I was so scared because she always in the room, in the shower, in the bathroom by herself. She's not happy like before, and dancing and making noises and everything. It was so bad that I started hurting myself, and I didn't tell anyone, but people started noticing how my attitude started changing because I'm really loud and outgoing, but I wasn't loud and outgoing anymore. I was really quiet, I was always in my room. I started seeing stuff in my arms and stuff. Sorry. She was crying in the room, one day she was in the bathroom and she's not get out. She was, I was scared. I was, I was trying to open the door hard and Shani, Shani, what's going on with you? And she coming out and she was caught herself, you know? And I don't, I don't like that. They said I was useless. They'd sent me things that no one would ever want to hear about themselves. And I thought like, Okay, they, was, they said I should do this, so why don't I listen to them and do it? I told her I don't want to lose you because of other people who are telling you all of these things. You gotta realize that these people 
are just insecure about themselves that they're just probably jealous of you because obviously Shani is super pretty. Shani has an amazing personality. I remember telling her like, I don't want to one day wake up and you being in the hospital because you're like a sister to me. I don't want to lose that bond with you. <laughs> How you feel now, Mia? Well, this yes. past months, uh, a lot of going on with the schools, changing schools, kids around. I'm happier that I changed schools. Yeah, this yeah. school's better. I gone to the to the principal and explain everything, what happened. I was getting mad and worried because they don't do nothing. They don't call the families, they don't do nothing. That's why we put in a different school. You look different, you know? Mm. Happy, mm. and that's what I, I, I'm happy too. You're happy, I'm happy, you know? <laughs> <laughs> she's so hyper, she's so happy. I know that's, that quinceanera is gonna make me happy too for her. It's <laughs> crying now. If I didn't tell anyone, I probably wouldn't be here right now. I probably wouldn't be getting my quinceanera ready. Yeah, I was bullied and I was depressed, but I don't want people to feel sorry for me because that actually helped me with like I can connect with other people now, like I can connect with teenagers, I can tell them, I went through this, you're not alone. Because I'm so much stronger, it's easy, I got this in the palm of my hand right now. Bye! Bye! Inside, you. Hi! Hi! How are you? I'm doing good, I'm doing good. Good, well, you want to try it on your dress? Yes, yes. Okay. Yes, please. I'm excited to see it. We're here at Rosie's store and I'm about to see the dress for the first time and I'm really excited. We went to another designer and he couldn't make my Alice Wonderland dress. So a month ago I went to Rosie's dress store and she's like, oh yeah, we can make it for you. We haven't made stuff like this in a while. And I said, oh, okay, okay, cool. I designed this dress for the Baila Sopresa. I'm gonna be Alice and the theme's Alice in Wonderland. I'm nervous, because what if she doesn't do it right? I'm nervous to see my Alice in Wonderland dress because we thought like no one could make it. It's hard to find clothes for Alice in Wonderland and when I come here and tell her to make her dress, I'm not sure if she can do it. So pretty. Now I'm so excited because it's so good. It's I like it. It's nice. <laughs> oh, oh, so I like I it. it. It's so beautiful. So beautiful. <laughs> so I tried on my dress and it came out exactly how I wanted it to. I'm so happy. It's every little detail that I wanted is on the dress. The only problem, like this dress is perfect, but can we fix this? Depends on what is the, your hair style and put mm -hmm. it on that clip. Okay. okay. Yeah. What do you think, Chloe? I really like it. It goes with your theme. You look really good. Jade, what do you think? See? Jade? The dress is beautiful. It's shiny. It's gorgeous. I'm so excited because, you know, it's just, um, her dream. You know? It's hard to find people to make her dress. And it doesn't look like those like raggedy ones, you know. <laughs> this one's nice. This yeah. one's really nice. Está bien bonito. Nice. I was kind of nervous that this dress wasn't going to come out the way I wanted to because I look online and I see all these Alice in Wonderland dresses, but they're not very well made. But this one actually looks real. It looks pretty. Not like a costume, but a dress. Thank you, Rosie, for the dress. It's so pretty. Oh. I'm even more excited about my quinceanera. It looks beautiful. <laughs> now that I have my Alice in Wonderland dress, I'm even more excited about my Baile Sopresa and my quinceanera. It's coming together. <laughs> I make lifestyle videos on YouTube and I really like editing and making videos. Hey guys, so right now we are getting ready. Can you tell that I'm getting ready? Because my dad said it's uh, really important and he said, oh, look nice. So I'm like, okay, I will. And so that's what I'm doing right now. We are in Venice. Love this place. Right this side, please. Thank you. This morning, my dad's like, oh, get ready. Put something nice on. And I'm like, why? And he's like, it's a surprise. Ah. Daddy, you like it? Yeah, it's so pretty. I 
I did not expect this, to be honest. I didn't think we were gonna come here. I'm actually really excited, because my whole family gets to come. Um, my sister, Nisha, my mom, and my dad, me. <laughs> hey, girl, check this out. <laughs> yeah. One more week, and we're done with this. Oh, yes. Emily, I'm so yeah, it's, it's so stressed. <laughs> <laughs> it's so stressed. I'm sorry, Chanita, but I'm so stressed. <laughs> I'm one week ahead you now from the uh, Kisanya, and I want to give this uh, surprise to my daughter. What do you think about everything? What we've been doing, I mean, it's... Uh, we're blessed. God help us a lot. I'm really excited to spend this time with him because my dad's a very busy guy. We barely get to see him, probably like once a week. I think after this, we should go shopping. I have, I have a better idea. What? We have You're gonna love it. We have a surprise for you. We have a surprise for you. You know what you're doing today? I'm getting on a helicopter. Where are you? <laughs> We're on the helicopter now, and my sister and I are grabbing hands, we're recording on our phones, we see like everything, we just see all these amazing things. I've been through a lot these last couple of months. I'm just glad that I'm happier now, I'm with my sister, I'm with my family, so that's all that matters. I was so nervous in the beginning, but now I kind of want to buy a helicopter. It was so much fun. I had a great day with my family, and I'm looking forward to my quince because this was my birthday present for my dad. So I'm glad. <laughs> We are in LA at my venue, Monte Cristo, where I'm gonna have my quinceanera. <laughs> Isn't it pretty? Yeah. It's really pretty. <laughs> Today, I'm seeing my venue for the first time, and it's exactly how I wanted it. Isn't it amazing? <laughs> so nice, how can you close? Like it. Isn't it pretty? <laughs> I like it. They even put the blue lights. The theme of my quince is Alice in Wonderland, and I love this place because like, it has the most important part, the stairs, because in the movie Alice in Wonderland, Alice opens the door to go inside Wonderland. And that's what I'm gonna do. Like the stairs, on the top of it, there's gonna be a door where I'm opening it and I go inside Wonderland, which is my party. <laughs> We're gonna practice right here, on this side facing people this side. So I'm gonna, that stairs, right? Yeah. Today, we're gonna practice the dance for the Baile Supresa and the waltz with my court. You come here with Shani, see if you guys can get her down. She's gonna open the door. Okay, she's gonna come in. And then, are you scared to come down? I'm scared of these two. Don't jump. <laughs> Don't jump, yeah. Like that. Like that? Or, they look ugly. Or well, you need to practice more. My name is Carlos. I'm one of Shani's main chamelanes. Me and Shani are very close because we grew up in Arkansas together. I don't like to dance, but since I'm very close to Shani, I have to dance. <laughs> and I come out as a mad hatter. Get the dancing right. Stop. Since the quinceanera is in three days, I'm very nervous. Yeah, I don't, I don't know why I can't sleep sometimes. <laughs> why? Because she scares me. <laughs> It's like a smack about you, because you ain't getting the dances right. I'm nervous because it's a big responsibility. I have to be her main chamelan and I have to dance very good next to her. If not, she looks bad. You guys ready? Yeah, fam. Okay, got this. In my Valle Supresa, I'm doing like a little scene from Alice in Wonderland. In the beginning, Alice runs after the white rabbit and that's what I'm gonna do. I got a choreographer. She was like a really professional choreographer, but then she bailed on us the second day and I was an emotional wreck. I kind of stopped crying. I'm like, oh, it's not coming out the way I wanted it to. But then my cousin's like, I'll do your baile sopraza for you. All right, let me see if I can adjust you guys. My name is Ashley, and I am Shani's choreographer for her surprise dance, and Shani's my cousin. Just let her do it, but then that means when you slide off, I really want you to like look away and like, turn your body and stuff. This is the first time practicing it here, so we're gonna make sure everybody has enough space. The dance itself doesn't concern me. What concerns me is if they can actually perform it right. It's important because I want it to look nice for Shani. I want Shani to look nice and everybody to be talking about it after, you know? We have to fix that. You actually waited, and that's why they all waited. Oh, because I forgot. 
we only have two hours to practice not only this dance, but the waltz also, so I'm hoping that we get it right. When she goes like that, that's when you let go of her. You, hold right. the whole, you never hold you her. You never hold her. Because I don't know that part. Okay, well. You don't know that part? Do it. Practice it. My name Tramadlan is Carlos, and we're having some kind of problem because he does not remember the dance steps. Wait, let me. Get but you slide off, remember? Yeah. See, but I don't want to. I don't want a pelvic thrust. <laughs> okay. Well, I told you guys don't. I told you guys to pop it. Remember? Five, six, seven, eight, four. You have to do it the same time she does. And we go over it all the time, but he doesn't remember it. <laughs> Ready? Yeah. Jump right then. Damn. Hold me right. Jenny. I need you here. Okay. Five, six, seven, eight. She's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Oh, he stepped on my foot. Vitos. <laughs> he really did step on my foot. My quinceanera is in three days and I'm getting angry. I'm getting frustrated because no one's doing good. Everyone's messing up, everyone's bumping into each other. And I'm even messing up because it's just bad. Actually, this is our first time practicing here and the dance floor is really small. So it's stressing them out. They feel like they don't have enough space and to move around and get to their places. Oh God, nothing's turning out the way I wanted it to, Ashley. Well, we just gotta keep practicing. I can toss I can, huh? toss messing up. I know, but we just gotta keep practicing. Chantal, she's completely off on every part. Every move, she's like off. She's either too fast or too slow, or she doesn't know it. Hold on, hold on. You guys need to go more back. That's making Shani stress out more. And then Chantal, we just gotta take one day and like literally practice over and over and over and over with her. Mm -hmm. I don't know what to do. <sighs> It's putting pressure on me, and Shani's putting pressure on me, and yeah. Oh my god, we are running out of time. Okay. We have like 30, 40 minutes left. Okay. Alright, let's go practice. And we still have to do the waltz. Knowing that we only have one time to practice here before the 15, and we only have a couple minutes left, and they still need to practice another dance, it just makes it more stressful. Let's do the girls. Five, six, seven, eight. Wait, okay, wait. You guys need to make sure you're right behind Shani when you guys are doing this part. Right behind her. Chantal, you need to go more that way. Okay, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Do you know it, Chantal? You're gonna let it swing out and then one, two. And then you're gonna turn and stop here. Chantal, you really need to practice because you're off on everything. It's like a coincidence because the, the thing that I'm mostly concerned about and the thing that I've been waiting for is my Viola Supressa and it's messing up. That doesn't make any sense. The 15th is Saturday. Yeah. And you're completely lost on everything. And that's making Shani freak out. So tomorrow, can you tell your mom so she can drop you off at my house? That way we can practice it. Yeah. So we're gonna do that tomorrow. Okay. I'm really worried about this. I'm getting frustrated. It's not coming out right. It's 9 a.m. and I'm so happy. I'm so happy right now <laughs> because today's the day of my quince and I honestly didn't think this was gonna happen because a year ago, I thought I was gonna be sad for this moment. I thought I was gonna be down and stuff, but I'm actually fine now. Hello, what's up, what's up, baby girl? Hi, Dan. How's everything? Finally, your day is on today. I'm excited. Yeah, I'm happy too, but... What happened? Dress. It's short. What like they short? never fixed it. Like they gave me the same dress. I'm having an issue with my main dress, which is the one that I'm gonna be dancing the waltz in and going to church with. Your mom, she said they're gonna fix it or give you another one. What I happened? Mean, I don't even think they gave me an, another one. This one's the same thing. My dress is a disaster. It's short from the bottom, so you can see like my ankles and my feet and stuff. We gave them enough time to do those things and, and, and they're coming with this boot crap, you know, that's not right. I need that number of that guy. I'm gonna call him. Three weeks ago, my mom and I went to try on the dress, but it was short for my ankles and they said they were gonna fix it. And the dress came last night and it was the same thing. Nothing changed. It's just And ridiculous. my mom was like arguing with those people. They didn't, they didn't even like iron it that well. It's still all crusty. That guy or whatever 
gave you that dress, it's lucky that I wasn't there, you know, because I'm, you know, crazy. I've been working hard to make my daughter's, you know, that uh, her dream come true. This is a special day for, for her. I love her and I want to do the best to keep her happy. That's not right. Okay. Where your mom? Living in. I'm here and I'm, I'll fix it. I'll take care of it. Okay. What happened with the dress? That was a big issue with the dress. The ladies over there, they're so mean, they don't want to help us. The dress was so short. The dress we have, it's short. We can see her feet. And with high heels, they don't look good. Do you have his number? I'm gonna, I'm gonna... I'm already give it to you. I want to call Nisha. Maybe we can do something about it and get a, a, oh, another shoe. Uh, the... My heels are pretty big, and my mom doesn't want like my feet to show. And Nisha. I have an issue with the dress and I need a small shoes. She's making my sister go and get me new heels, like a little shorter. As soon as you can, you finish your makeup and come back here. This is Carlos Monroy. L listen to me, listen to me. That's not a good excuse. I need you, please. Fast. Come on. People pay. No, no, no. See, now we're going to have to go and get shoes. We got that, That's that's not good. I'm talking to the owner of the place where they got the dress, you know. Oh, come on, man. I just had a fight with this guy, you know, because they want to do whatever they want, you know. Try to do it faster. Thank you, me. Okay, bye. Is she mad? Yeah, she's mad because she's supposed to come in and do my makeup, and she she don't have no time. Don't worry, <clears throat> everything's gonna be fine. It's your day. It's Chinese day, so be happy. <laughs> my dress is like a disaster, but I have to wear it anyways. Are you excited? Oh, yeah, it's your day. Yeah, but I'm not that excited feel? anymore. Everything's Why? getting on my nerves. I'm at my grandma's house right now, and my aunt's doing my hair. My aunt is a hairstylist. Whatever happens, enjoy your moment, and don't let it stress you. I remember, Shani, when you were you were little, and you were talking about this day, and how it's going to be, how different you want it to be. When you're going to make me cry. <laughs> You kept saying, oh, and I want Carlitos to be my, uh... Chambelan. Yeah, Chambelan. Okay. Help me with that, please. Okay. I take this. I'm breaking. You know how I invited 15 people? I don't know what happened, but like, now like only like some of them are coming. I invited 15 of my friends to my quinceanera. I don't know how many are coming still, but. And my mom's like, well, family's more important. And I'm like, yeah, you're right. Family is more important. It actually hurts a lot because it's not the first time it happens to me. I was celebrating my 13th birthday. I invited a lot of people, I know that, and none of them showed up. No one showed up, not one person. Those are little things that you shouldn't let that affect you. Don't pay attention to that. If they come, be happy that they're there, and if they're not, then it's okay. Yeah. I'm trying to be positive and not trying to let it get to me. Honey, have you seen Kalita? A Manhattan outfit? Oh. No, I haven't seen it. Yeah, I like Look at the, the hat. The hat's cool. It comes with the hair. <laughs> I'm in love with Mad Hatter. It's so cool. And I'm having my cousin play Mad Hatter. Well, there's only one problem. What is it? We forgot the pants. You forgot the pants? Yeah, you know how Carlitos is. He tried it on and he left it in the dressing room. Oh my God. And then he, got, he gets out and he gets out with the rest of the costume and the pants stay in the dressing room. You love the pants in the dressing room. <laughs> So your mom's not here because she's she went over there to try to get the pants. I'm here with my aunt and my mom's like trying to get the pants for him. So yeah. Myra, are you serious? You're still here? Bye bye. Bye. It's just the more stress. Extra thing. Yes. Stress on top of us. Okay. I am feeling stressed because the makeup person's not here, my mom's not here, my sister's not here, and like the church starts in like two hours. So Hey guys, it's Shani. Say hi, Emily. Hi. And today is my quinceanera day. <laughs> Woo! Turn up. I'm vlogging today for my YouTube channel because I make lifestyle videos on YouTube. My makeup artist is here. I'm about to get my makeup done. I already have my hair done and I'm so excited. Yay! Yeah. <laughs> hi. Hi, Shani. Hi, Wendy. Oh, you look so handsome. What's up, homie? <laughs> <laughs> I'm excited. Shani chose me as her main chamberlain. It's gonna be fun with dancing with her. And uh, he used to be high school. Ryan, I used, to, I used to be Ryan. I used to be Sharpay. 
I feel confident about the dances because I added my own little mix to it. So. Oh my god. <laughs> I know what you're gonna do. You're so weird. <laughs> you guys have to hurry up because it's really getting late. And, and at a mass, if we're late, they, they don't. They cancel. Yeah, they cancel everything. The church is really strict, so if we're not on time, we can't have the mass. Shani, where are the rest of the chambelanes? They're supposed to come. Call your mom? My mom doesn't have her oh. phone. Your mom is not even ready. Oh my goodness. <laughs> I'm stressing out here. Jenny's mom um, left her phone here. She's supposed to be here like an hour ago. Hello? ¿Dónde estaban los chambelanes? Oh my goodness. They're here? They're on their way, and Alan was going to take him with him that he hasn't had his hair cut. <laughs> but <laughs> I'm really stressed out right now because everything's not working out the way we have planned. Hello? This is her daughter. She left her phone. I wish my mom was here with me because I feel like everything's on me now. Here, I don't know who this is. People are gonna call me. Oh, what do I do? What do I do? I don't know. Uh, no, she's not here. She forgot her phone. I think I'm gonna cry. Ooh. Yeah, yeah, what time are you here? The photo guy, it's already running late and he's sending somebody else. Okay, well, um, can you please have that person get here? Because mass is at 1 and by 12 we would have been out of here already. That's very disturbing because I really don't know this guy's work, so... We agreed on 12, and so I'm going to find out where they're at. I'll call you back. Okay, I told my sister to cancel, but I guess she didn't, so... Now we're here, and they're not here. The guy that your mom contracted for the pictures, he's not, gonna, he's not here. I think he's sending somebody else. I don't know what your mom is doing. <laughs> And my mom's not even here to talk to anyone. Um, like, I don't know what I'm supposed to do. I am feeling stressed because my mom's not here, my sister's not here. The day of my quince is here. <gasps> oh my god. Okay, so your makeup's good for now, so just go put on your dress. I just got my makeup done, and I'm in a hurry to go and get dressed right now. We have less than 45 minutes to go to the church and get dressed. Chani, le deseo muchas felicidades. So my mom's not here to help me get ready, so my grandma has to help me. You guys are late, man. You guys are not ready? Oh, my God. It's crazy. Oh, my God. 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 Oh, done. my dress is on. So this is what my dress looks like. It's all poofy and blue like Alice in Wonderland. Before, I thought I was going to be sad and depressed because a year ago I was getting bullied in school. It was so bad that I started hurting myself, but now I'm happy. I feel great. Wow, look at that! <laughs> oh my god, look at you, my beautiful little tiny girl. Woo! Wow. Ooh. It doesn't matter. <laughs> now that I see her, it's like, oh my gosh. I was wondering, where's my little tiny girl? The little one. You know? oh <laughs> I still love her, like the day I saw her when she was born, you know. And you just feel like crying, you know. You just feel like, like crying. I've been saving money through all these years, you know, for this moment to give them that. I'm sorry. The type of life that I never had, you know, they, they, they had it. When I was a kid, I never had a toy. I love you. I love you too, Dad. Oh. <laughs> wow. I'm making my daughter happy, and it's just wonderful. Speechless. How I feel. We're we'll crying again. All right, guys. We have 30 minutes left. Let's go. Come on. We have to go. Honey, you didn't fix my hair. Don't be touching it. Oh, you have a lot of shit. Hello, Toyo. Oh no, Toyo. I kissed my dress. It's dirty now. I picked up my dress and like it hit my face, so it got my lipstick and it left a stain. Hey, please! It doesn't come off. Mira, it's pintura. So now my grandma was trying to fix it, and it 
hasn't came off yet. Hey everybody, we got 20 minutes. The limousine is gonna be here in 20 minutes. Out there. 20 minutes. Where'd it go? It's right here. My grandma said it takes 15 minutes to get the stain off with the hairspray. So now we're just waiting. I'm at Griffith Park and I'm taking photos with my family. This experience is amazing. My family is very supportive and awesome. We are about to go to my venue and my party is about to start and I'm so excited, so happy. <laughs> We're about to go to Shani's limo and head to the party and, and have fun. Turn up, turn up. <laughs> <laughs> we just got to the venue and this is the first time I've seen it without its decorations and I'm really excited. Na, 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 na. Woo! Woo! So pretty! I just walked into my venue and I'm so happy. I'm, oh, it's so pretty. Oh my god, this is so... Look at the butterflies! Look at this, this is so cool! This is all for me! I love it. Do you guys see this? my table for my courts. It's the tea party that Mad Hatter's at, so you have the teacups and stuff, but there's little flying butterflies. It's so cool. Wow, the mushrooms. Yes! Okay, this is so cool, okay. Oh my god. Look at that table. Oh, it's so pretty. <laughs> Look at that cake. Crooked. It's crooked, but that's the style. I love the butterfly. Oh. I just want to eat everything. So what do you think about Everything. And then came out really nice. Like everything came out exactly the way I wanted it. Can I get a hug? At least. Thank you. Oh my god. Yeah. I'm sweating. <laughs> my aunt made my candy table. She did really good. Like amazing. I'm gonna show you something. Come here. Look at this. Oh my god. Oh my god. It's so <laughs> my dad just showed me the door and it's so nice. I. That surprised me. Does it open? It does. It does open. Look. Look. Nothing. Nothing. <laughs> yep. Finally, oh hey, we got we, we got so everything. Cool. For the waltz and the baile sorpresa, I have to have a door. It's a surprise to everyone. My theme is Alice in Wonderland, so in the movie, she walks in a dorm, and that's what I'm gonna do in my waltz and my baile sorpresa. Come on, nice! I love the door. <laughs> oh, that's good. I still can't believe today is my quinceanera. Mikeins is going so well right now. I love it. It's perfect. We're at my venue and it's pretty bomb. I'm vlogging today for my YouTube channel because I make lifestyle videos on YouTube. This is my table. Guys, look, there's butterflies. I've been dreaming of this day for a very long time and I'm so happy this happened. I still can't believe today is my quinceanera. It's so crazy. This is really nice. I didn't, I didn't expect it like this. <laughs> When I was celebrating my 13th birthday, I invited a lot of people, I know that, and none of them showed up. I was nervous because I invited 15 of my friends to my quinceanera, and most of them showed up, which I'm really happy about. Try this one. Try this one. Okay. It's still What the heck? We're about to go do Shiny's waltz, and we're getting really nervous. Don't mess up his hair, though. Yeah, man. We're scared that we look like fools out there. I need to practice this thing. Taking off No, you grab it from here. There's a mess in here. It's too crazy. I'm really nervous because usually when we practice, it doesn't turn out nice. You know, it's really messy. But fingers crossed, everything comes up right. This is a disaster. Buenas noches, buenas noches, por favor, tomen asiento. Y después de eso, entra el vals. My waltz, I've been dreaming about this forever. It's finally happening. We're gonna start off with the father-daughter dance. For me, as a father, it's a big moment. One of the biggest moments. I remember I used to dance with her when she was a baby, you know. You just get those memories back and it makes you feel, you know, like very fragile, like, Wanted to cry, and you know, it's very beautiful. 
normally it's just dad and daughter, but my dad has been there for me like through everything, but also my mom. My mom helped me go through the depression when I was getting bullied in school. I say thanks to God because they gave me all the opportunities to have my daughter with me. Now, she's so happy. We're gonna move to Canal's Wonderland song where I'm gonna dance with all the boys. The people that are in my court, it's family. All of them are like cousins. My main chamelan is Carlos, the Mad Hatter. Shani's had a very difficult life. I'm very happy that she's enjoying this container right now. It's going great. It's amazing, I mean, just beautiful. Getting ready for the Baile Sofesta. Pretty excited. Shani looks really nice. Like, we haven't seen her like that. Hoping that this dance makes Everybody move out there and get on the dance floor. We don't want to mess up. There's a lot of girls out there, so we gotta make good impressions. <laughs> I'm about to do my surprise dance, and I'm really nervous and excited at the same time because when we practiced it, it wouldn't come out right, but I'm really excited because we have our costumes on. Shani, Monroy, my baile sopresa is the main reason I want to do my quinceanera. I've been dreaming about having my baile sopresa since I was like five. It was just electricity running through my body. Every move that I hit, I had to hit it with purpose. My court did really good. I'm very happy. <laughs> we just finished all of my dances and they went amazing. My quince went so well. Everything turned out exactly the way I wanted it to. I went through a lot this past last year. And, you know, that's behind me. That's a different part of me. I'm happy now, that's all that matters. This really was my dream King Sanita. For more King Set content, click the box down below to watch more. And don't forget to subscribe to the Awesomeness TV My Dream King Sanita channel.